like three days ago. Now, if we get the impacts of our Category 5, because that's a speculation, uh, we may be in trouble for that here. But let me tell you what's going on with Tropical Depression Aaron that formed as a tropical storm firm first. That's why we keep the name. And then it moved into Texas. Now it's uh, making landfall. Uh, 19 kilometers per hour. It's not a massive system, but it's coming to an area that has got a lot of rain lately, so it's saturated here. I'm talking about Corpus Christi. Also, a little bit inland, we have... Um, many other big cities, San Antonio, for example. So this uh, cyclone will continue to move there, bring some rain, uh, probably some floods, but it's not a big, big, big thing. The really big hurricane that we have is Dean, as you see coming to the Lesser Antilles. Also, we have many CNN international viewers uh, that uh, are in uh, ships here, in cruise line ships in the Caribbean, and they need to know what's gonna happen. Well, you see, it keeps intensifying. Uh, we're gonna see it on a category two in 24 hours, then three, and we think that all the chances are there for the cyclone to go here in between Cuba and the Yucatan Peninsula and come into the Gulf of Mexico. If that happens, it may make it on a Category 5 status, so that's pretty bad. We'll keep you up to date. And also, we have a super typhoon that is going into Taiwan, and it's